Now it's important to remember that uh, what we're learning is web design and this is an enormous amount of content and I don't want you to be spending all your time doing lots and lots of content on your website. It's more a case of <coughs> demonstrating that you can do structure and design aspects of the web design. So I'm just going to copy that link there and in my page, this is why I've got the read more text at the end of each page. It enables me just to have a demonstration, a sentence or two, and for the rest, I can just link to the website, save the changes, and then we can see what that looks like when I've uploaded it. I'm just going to upload that page. It's also important to remember that there are, there is a lot of stuff that you can do on a website and you can't be expected to do all of it. I'm looking for a range of content and I've included a lot of videos, but you don't need to do all of the techniques that I'm demonstrating. I'm just trying to be comprehensive enough so that you can um, see how to use it. So if I look back at the index page, for example, I put in one demonstration sentence, a video, and then I'm going to have the link to the SharePoint site. That's all I'm really looking for.